They're both on the website. Uh -huh. These are the puppies off of that first litter. So we want to go ahead and get them on there as well. This is a male, Mitchell, five weeks today. Yes, five weeks today. All right. Were you able to get a still shot of him? Yep. If, um, you want to put him down or, or how you want to do oh, that? Good. Yeah, will he good. stand? Yeah, if you put him. If he can. I think he okay. will stand. Can you try to stack them? There you go. I think you're good. Um, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna circle him. Okay. That's perfect. If he just lift his head up, that's the shot right there. Hey. Hey there. Mitchell. Hey Mitchell. Hey Mitchell. You can get that down. <laughs> That's fine. If you got okay. a decent shot, yeah, I got a good one. Go ahead and get the other one. I don't want to keep one for the mama too. Yeah, I want to okay. see the uh see the uh the girl that's pregnant by Grizz real quick too. Okay. This is Major. Also five weeks today. Both of these guys are off bear and mystique. Hey, Major. <laughs> oh. You just brought these two? Yeah, those are the only two that's, that's left. Yeah, okay. okay. The other two already, you know, the girl and the one that he got. Those okay. are the only other two left. Hi. All right. Yeah, yeah, thank you, guys. Yeah, Her name is Carol. Uh -huh. And she is pregnant by Grizzly Bear. She's an oldie. All the dogs that we're going to be looking at today are oldies. Okay. And the puppies. Um, we'll be ready. Actually, they'll be born in about four more weeks. Right, did you get a good shot of her? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna put her back. Okay. I'm gonna take her. What I'm gonna do is like all the um, the dogs that have bred, the males and females. I'm gonna bring those out back to back. Okay. That way, because I'd like to get a picture of her and him in the front, so people can see that puppy's coming off of Grizz and Carol. Come on. But this is her, man. That's the one by Grizz. This is the one by Grizz. That's the right? only one by Grizz. This is the right only now. one by Grizz right now. Right, right, okay. But my um my red boy in here has got this black female pregnant. Right here? This, okay. Him? He got her pregnant? The red male in there? Over there. Uh-huh. Okay. You can see her belly's already starting to show. Right. But those, right. that's gonna be nice. Not the one in the corner. Uh-huh, but my red male. Oh, um, Rosa's? Son Rosa's or, son, yep. Okay, Rosa's son. Uh huh. Not the one in the far corner. Mm -mm. Is that the boy or girl? That's an English. Corner? That's an English. She's straight English. That's a little. English. That's a female. Okay. She's coming in the heat too. Okay. So she's gonna be real nice, man. And what that pup come off of, right? That's there? off of um, Shmoo, my all white female inside. Okay. Okay. All right, bro. I'm gonna. Get all right, let you go ahead and go. I'll, I'll holler at you. You know it. All right, here, brother. All right. All right. We'll see you later. Did you see the girl? Right here. Come on. This is my big boy right here. Come on. Come on, get up, knucklehead. This is my big boy. Calm down, calm down. He wants to play. He's he's a year and a half, but he got a lot of puppy left in him. But mm -hmm. this is the daddy to Carol's puppies. And they'll be born. You see, he's a big, big male. Now, this is a Victorian style old English bulldog. Thanks for getting slobber all over me, man. Um, and so I put him with a regular OD that'll shorten the puppies down just a little bit, um, but it'll keep them real nice and thick. Now, Grizz, to stud to Grizz, it's gonna be $2,000. His puppies are probably gonna run at about um, uh, $2,000 to $2,500 a piece. But I want to go ahead and get these puppies shown as soon as they get here. They're going to be my show dogs. I'm going to put them in the competitions in the show ring. Turn around so he can see you. Did you get a good shot of him? Okay. This is my, this is my big boy right here. Come on. The goal is to get a yard full of him. 
everything else on the yard. I'm going to sell off. I'm going to keep keep some puppies off of everything. But um, as far as all the other adults, I'm going to sell all of them. And I'm running a whole line. I'm bringing everything back to him. And the goal is to have about 20 of him on the yard in all different colors. Blues, blue tries, black, black tries, lilacs, champagne, everything. But uh, this is my perfect style right here. And I'm breeding him with that, that white oldie female that we just took a picture of. And uh, make a little bit shorter, stockier version of him. I'm gonna bring this female out. Back dynamite. This female right here, her name is Shirley. Now her mom is a Neo Sharpe cross and her daddy is a um an old E. So she's an F1 first generation. And I've got her bred to my little male over there. His name is Mugga. Called the Mugga Mugga short for the Ugga dog. And you can see her belly's already starting to get big. But let me stack her up so we can get a good shot of her. Come on. Come on, Charlie. Come on, Tom. Come on, get out there. She's being lazy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Get your head up. Got it? Mm hmm Okay. And you got a still shot of that one. Uh, yeah, right for a second. You want to give him another? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a good one. Cool. Got it? Okay. Yep. And I'm going to bring out the male that she's great too. I'm going to do all of the um, the three breeding pairs that I have. I have um, three females that are bred by these three males. And I'll do all the other dogs after. Now this male, his name is Mugga Mugga. And I actually have his mama here. His daddy is a straight English bulldog. Um, I put a lot of English bulldog into my oldies. Real short, stocky, nice, thick male. Don't show him your butt. <laughs> and um, his mom is the same color scheme as him. His daddy is an English bulldog named Tank in South Carolina. Did you get a shot of him? Still shot? Uh, hold on. Okay, come on, turn around. Let's he doesn't want to shoot your butt. Come here, turn around. All right, there we go. Look up. Pay attention. There we go. Beautiful. Got it? Yep. Okay, cool. So, uh, those are two breeding pairs we just brought out. Um, Carol and Grizz, those two have bred. They're going to have a litter coming in a few weeks. Then brought out Mugga and Shirley. And they'll be having a litter right behind Carol's litter. And right now I'm going to bring out, she's real, real fat. I'm going to bring her out first and this other male. And then we'll look at the other dogs. Let me grab them there inside. So this is like clockwork for you. you oh, yeah. <laughs> Three litters right back to back. Wow. So this is considered a full-time job at this point? <laughs> it is. It is. Yeah. I'm probably doing about um, between 25 and 35 hours a week with just the dogs that I have here. Including? Between feeding, shots, shampooing, walking, taking care of all of, um, you know, every, every uh, was twice a week, got to spray the yard down for flies and mosquitoes and gnats and all that to make sure because the mosquitoes can get in their water and mosquitoes will um, the dogs actually um, swallow the mosquito larva that's what gives them heartworms <clears throat> so twice a week um, we spray the whole yard down of course got to clean it every single day clean out the kennels every single day um, change their water every day or every other day um, you know whenever it rains you see the rocks that are down here that they had to put that down because it's on a hill and it starts to kind of wash away a little bit so, um, and then I probably use about three or four bales of hay, um, uh, packing into the grass where the, the yard is kind of washing away, 
fresh cedar chips. So it's about 25 to 35 hours, and this is just with, I've got about, what, 20 dogs here, and that's 25 to 30 hours just with that. So, and you're talking about doubling the amount of dogs. Well, I'm getting ready. I'm, I'm looking at some, um, some property that my family owns and um, I'm moving out there, and I'm doing a little bit more, but I'm gonna have to hire some other people uh, to help me. Right. And I wanna start getting into the shows. Been checking out the shows, going to visit a few people, but uh, I'm looking at grizzly bears, um, puppies, entering them into the shows. Then I've got a real nice puppy I'll show you in a minute. Her daddy's a blue tri, and her mom's a um, sable blue fawn off of a dog named Champion Prime. And she's a blue and lilac tri. And she's going to be one of my show dogs as well.